my absolute everyday favorite Asian sauce. That's the coconut peanut butter that I show here. It's very easy to make and it tastes fantastic. Try it, I make it like this. As I usually do, I start with the prep work and this means the vegetables. First off, I remove the, the peel from the broccoli. The, the scent of the broccoli is some of the best flesh on the, some of the best stuff on the broccoli. Then I remove the corners, the edges, to get the last peel off. And what's left now is some a really nice vegetables. And it's firm and it tastes a little bit like peas. And it cooks up really well. And it's a shame to let that go. The rest of the broccoli, I cut into very thin slices. You can break it off into bouquets, but I, I prefer this because it cooks more evenly and I, I have better control over the size and I cut them on the long side. So the, the, basically they should fit in your mouth. That's the basic rule here. Carrot, cut off the ends, peel it, cut it in half so it's stable and then cut at an angle. So they're the same size as the rest of the vegetables. And the same with the spring onion. The bell pepper. Take off the little pieces from the at the end too. They are no reason to throw them out. Remove the seeds. They have no function in a in a bell pepper. In a chili, they are strong, but not in this. They're just annoying. So I got this zigzag pattern to get them about the same size as the rest of the vegetables. Again, they should fit in your mouth and they're done. So that's an easy prep. Add a little bit of coconut oil. The peanut butter. This is to, re to prevent it from lumping. And it's very easy to get lumps if you just pour all the peanut butter into the coconut milk. So don't do that. Do it like this a little bit at first. Then add the soy sauce, the fish sauce and the rest of the coconut. Let it cook up so it's all dissolved. And when you're sure there are no lumps in it, add the vegetables. They should only cook two minutes or something like that. They're raw, so you can eat it like a raw salad, but uh, up to 10 minutes you can cook it. Then they're a little softer. And all that's left now is to arrange on your plate and eat a healthy meal. So enjoy. And you can find the list of ingredients and the recipe on Quelly Food.